name is Amy Ecker and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to do an all day wear test using this Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay in Place Makeup. Will it stay in place or won't it? We're going to find out. Prime. So stay tuned. And we are going to get started using the Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay in Place Makeup and this is 1 and 2 Ecru. So I'm going to put a little bit of this on my brush. Pretty. I like it better when the foundations have a pump. Although the packaging is nice. It's a nice, pretty frosted glass. I still wish I had a pump. So I need a little bit more. As far as the priming, I just use the Scandinavia makeup spray as my primer. Let's see the initial impressions. Really nice with this brush. So I like that. I like that it didn't leave brush streaks. So that is sitting or absorbing into the skin nicely. It looks like it is definitely full coverage, which is always great for me. For some reason it's picking up really white on this camera. I'm not quite sure why it's doing that. It's not as white in person as it is, looks like it is on camera. Anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish my makeup. We'll see how this holds up during the rest of the work week. Wish me luck. Or wish I see. Alright, so it's the end of a work day. It wasn't a super long one like last week, thankfully, and I did not blot or um, touch up any. So let's see what the end of the day uh, thoughts are on this Estee Lauder Double Wear. Double Wear? Did it do double the time? I don't know. Let's check it out. Okay, so totally hot today. Um, I wish I would have looked at the temperature. It was, it was pretty crazy. Pretty crazy as far as heat goes. Um, Although my eyelashes didn't fall down my face like they did last time it was super hot. Just kidding. Okay. Chin held up nice. That's always a good sign. I do have um, some marks, it looks like, from my sunglasses. And I've got some cakiness going on on the nose. It's like my glasses slid down my face and made um, some divots in the slope there. But, and then on this side, definite cakiness around the nose and the, um, again, the glasses. To be honest, I only used a priming spray. Totally forgot to use a setting uh, spray. So this would be just with a primer on, no finishing spray. I will say it kind of does look cakey in some areas like right here. You can see my oils have come through and my nose just looks fake. So it's like the uh, where this morning the double wear had kind of soaked into the skin. It's like as I've gotten oily or sweaty during the day. Sounds disgusting, I know. Um, it's like it pushed the product up off of the skin instead of it sinking into the skin like how pretty it was this morning. So I would say overall, I mean, it didn't do bad. I would say I would um, to keep this foundation on all day and having it look nice. I probably would need to blot. And I don't know that I have any blotting powder powders. Powders? I can't even speak. No, I have no blotting things um, here. I don't know how that happened, but. Again, I'm thinking that if it was blotted during the day and the oils were pulled off the skin, maybe it would sit better. Also, I didn't use, again, a setting spray, so that could be part of the problem also. But overall, I think it did good. I just don't like how it looks on my nose whatsoever. Chin ended up okay. Usually my chin and nose are my hot messes. So if you have used the Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay in Place makeup, have you had the trouble that I did where it's kind of pushed Thank up? Thank you so much for watching my video today on this Estee Lauder all day 
stay double wear, stay in place makeup, foundation review, and first impressions. So as you know, uh, as far as the first impression goes, I thought it did wonderful. So if you liked this video, um, please consider giving it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing or refer me to a friend. And if you liked this double wear stay in place makeup, um, I'd actually like to hear what your thoughts or comments are on this. Um, for my dry ladies, my combo ladies, and my oily ladies. Do you like it? Does it work for you? Are you impressed with it? Um, is it worth the money to spend? I really want to hear what your thoughts are after my thoughts. So anyways, I hope you have a wonderful day and as always, you have a choice. So make it a great one. Until next time.